y'all. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back. If you've been here before, I'm Beautiful Love Ever, a.k.a. Tay. So I'm going to use my Juvia's Place Primer in Shade 2 and my AB8 Setting Powder to set it. And you have to shake this or it'll come out really liquidy, so shake it first before you use it. Okay, now I'm going to use the Morphe by Ivany Gray for the Bebs palette. And I'm going to take that gray shade and put it all over my lids. And then once I do my eyeliner, um, I'm going to take the orange shade and put it on top of it. But I end up using that third orange at the top because the other orange um, didn't show up as well. And right here, y'all, I'm just using my um, Juvia's Place Warriors 2 palette. And I use those first two shades as transition colors. Now I'm going to use my Maven Beauty Liquid Eyeliner. And right here is just where I'm putting that um, orange color. I did come on and wet the brush a little bit uh, for it to show up a little better. Now I'm using my AOA Studio um, Lash Glue and my Ioni Fluffy Full Feather Lashes. And to make sure there's no gap showing, I'm going to use my Sephora um, eye pencil and also my Essence mascara. Moving on to the face, I'm using my L'Oreal Moisture Filler Moisturizer. And then I'm going to use my Everyday Humans Rose from Above Mineral Sunscreen. Now I'm going to use NARS Pour and Shine Control Primer. Now I'm using my LA Girl Pro Conceal Orange Corrector just to correct the dark spots in my face and as well as my neck. Mm -hmm. 
Now I'm using Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Soft Matte Foundation. This is in the shade 425. Now I'm going to use my Elf Camel Concealer and Deep Cinnamon. I'm just going to use this for some more coverage and put this all the places where I put my orange corrector. Now to highlight, I'm using my Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer, and I believe this is a medium dark warm. And I just put this all the places where the light would naturally hit. Now while that's sitting, I'm going to use the Juvia's Place Bronzer Palette in Dark, and I'm going to take the top shade to contour my nose and go around my jawline area because it's lighter. And then I'm going to use the other shade to um, bronze the other parts of my face. And I blend out that concealer and now I'm just using my ABA setting powder to set it. Now for my all over face powder, I'm using my Fenty Beauty Soft Matte Powder Foundation in 440. Now I'm going to take the Juvia's Place Saharan Blush Volume 1 palette. And I'm going to use that brownish shade right there and the orange shade is my blush. Now I'm going to use my Eben Radiant Glitter Dual Stick. One side is a primer, the other side is glitter. And so I used the, um, the primer side as like a lipstick and then I used um, a combination of both of those uh, for my, um, right to go right in the inner parts of my eyes. So I put down the primer and then I put the glitter on top of it. Now I'm going to use my Cover Effects um, Setting Spray. And that is it y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed this um, look, this gray um, eyeshadow look with uh, pops of orange and a gray lip. So um, I just wanted to try something a little different. Um, I do like the dual stick. It is something different, so I'm glad I tried it. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, share, all that good stuff. Um, I do upload a short every Monday and a video every Friday. And I'll see you on the next one. Make sure you take care of yourselves. Bye.